I think it was like 15 different jobs I applied for, and everybody turned me away because of my background. And then nobody wanted to hire me and give me a second chance. You know? But you know, Roots gave me a second chance, so I'm, I'm thankful for that. Well, my life before Emancipated initially was a living hell. It was on the streets, sold drugs uh, to support my kids, my fiance. Um, I did whatever it takes to put food on the table. I just didn't have any like hope. I applied for 100 jobs and couldn't even get a phone call back for one interview because of one, one charge. Um, it's kind of, it's sad, it's a little depressing. It makes you want to do stuff that you know you shouldn't be doing just to survive. Many of our patients and clients would report that they were relying on things like general assistance um, over illegal activities to sustain them and would go in and out of incarcerated settings. So many people expressed a feeling of being stuck. And the soul piece is the piece that allows these men to stand up and be proud of what they do. Since I've been a part of the Mass Formative Initiative, I have learned how to work with different personalities. I've learned how to combine different elements together to make soap. Um, I learned new study habits, um, a total new skill set. It's important because going back into the real workforce, you have to have that. First and foremost, I learned how to be a man. Second thing, I learned how to just stay focused, stay on track, you know, do, do what's right. I've seen individuals start the program who have been estranged from their families, um, have been resorting to crime, have been homeless, or um, just going from house to house sleeping on couches. I see literally a transformation after they begin the initiative and really build their skills, they build their confidence, they remove a lot of the barriers that they've been previously experiencing. It's just not a name. It's an approach, and our approach meaning that we take the individual and we clean the individual up 360 degrees. And we, what we mean by that is we make sure that the individual's healthy. Before you enter the, the initiative, you go through a battery of tests to make sure that you're, you have the optimal health, physical health, your mental health, you approach your mental health. And the other piece is we start to address your finances. We address how you behave at home address how you behave in the community. I mean, I feel good now. You know, I feel real positive about myself. You know, and, and, you know, I feel good for my family. I have a bank account now. I've been paying bills on time. You know, so I, you know, I feel real good, real confident. Man, it was like a born child come, coming into this world with a brand new family. You know, you know, everybody showed me love. Not a lot of people give people with uh, felonies or even misdemeanors an opportunity to, to get back into society. And this job definitely uh, gives me hope.